Welcome back viewers and subscribers of AVG News. My name is Mkoli Sinube. Uh, there are people who have been asking me uh, about the application for asylum seekers permits and renewing uh, existing applications. So these are the ones that I'm going to respond to in this short video. Uh, before I go ahead, may I please request you to subscribe to this channel like this video and share it so that you can reach out or it can reach out to other people who need the same kind of information so that in the near future we do not continue to respond to people who raise issues that we would have responded to earlier on uh, the truth of the matter is that uh, there hasn't been any much movement in terms of uh, processing new applications for asylum seekers because we are told we are not certain about that but we are told that the walk-ins uh, into the refugee reception offices have not yet fully resumed so people who have tried to go there have either been turned away or uh, failed to receive certain kinds of services uh, the online application has only been availed to those who are renewing their asylum seeker permits and not those who seek uh, new applications for asylum seeker documents and refugee documents. Uh, and those that made some, re uh, some application for renewal uh, some months ago have still not yet, mostly, most of them have still not yet received any outcomes they don't know if their applications are going to be uh, processed uh, positively or not because they are yet to receive any outcomes. So they don't know if they are going to have any renewals or they're going to be turned away. But what we are hearing, which is some form of a worrying uh, bit of news, is that there are many others, again, who have been uh, turned away based on a generalization that a certain type of country uh, is not at war and therefore everyone who comes seeking asylum is being turned away and some of those countries include Zimbabwe uh, and others are from uh, Somalia and so we are told that there have been some rejections of those and especially those who are from Zimbabwe have been given uh, some documents or have been sent messages that they should come and receive their asylum seeker uh, they, they should come and receive their outcomes uh, but some of them have gone there and they've been told given uh, forms that say within 14 days they should have vacated south africa uh, so this is what we are getting we are not certain as yet if this is a blanket uh, decision as we have been told by those uh, that say uh, they have been told by people within the home affairs department but as soon as we get that we are going to come back here and inform you but this is what we have been told that people from especially Zimbabwe have not had their asylum seeker documents uh, renewed they have been told especially those whose, whose document were due for renewal have been told to leave the Republic of South Africa within 14 days, failure to which they will be arrested and deported. We are not uh, at this moment in time confirming anything, but only relaying what we have been told uh, by those who have tried to renew their documents, but mainly those who are in the majority, uh, those who tried to renew their permits have not yet been responded to, especially those who tried to renew via email that was given last time. So thank you very much. May you please subscribe to this channel, like this video, and share it.